Hello everybody and welcome back to Roguelike Roulette. We are playing Wizard of Legend yet again today. In the last run we had of this game, we had a pretty good time actually. We got a bit further than I thought we would have. We managed to unlock a few new things. We got this little bird thing here, this falcon that was very powerful towards the end of the run. I really didn't understand the build to start with, but it kind of it kind of balled out of control towards the end there. So now we've got a few more things to mess around with here. So we can go with increased air damage, add a chance to burn first, add a chance to freeze first. Those. Let's try and go for a um, that's a chance to fire off a pair of dragon axe and using basic arcana. That sounds really cool. Um, Shall we try and go with that? Actually, that sounds that sounds really interesting. So we'll, we'll put that on, and let's see if we can build some sort of fire-based build here. I can't remember what we bought from this guy last time around, so let's have a little look. See, basic. We want to be using the fire one for that. Dash. We've still only got one dash. Standard. We can go with Herming Flares, which I really like the idea of, and our signature. We could go with the Dragon Circuit, or we could go with one of these two. I really don't know which one to go for for this, but let's... We've already done Dragon Arc. I want to see if we've got anything new that we can use. Uh, release a volley of piercing winds in a kern. Um... Let's try and do the, the Gust Volley and go with that. Because uh, that means we've got air and fire as our sort of two that go together. And actually, I'm thinking that maybe we want to try out this instead. The the Knuckles, basic. So it seems like it's a pretty slow moving one. So, mm, I want to I see one that gets like the most Dragon Arcana out there. So if we do if we do this one... This one doesn't seem to be procking the dragon too quickly either. It procked it once. That one, the the fist procked it twice. And let's go with the, the flame strike. That's once, twice, three times, four times, five times. Okay, yeah, this is definitely going to be the way to go. Uh, we'll definitely go on to the fists in the next one, but... Yeah, I just want to try out some, like, new and different things and make sure we're having fun and making some builds that kind of go together and we're, we're using our relics nicely and all that sort of stuff and... Just, just have a good time with it. Wow, this is a, a dead end. A really, really dead end. Either way, we'll make our way forward. Got to remember how to play this. Um, I'm coming off uh, not playing this for a while. Oh, my God. I remember I changed one of my keys to... Um, that was very nice. I changed one of my keys to, to um, using this on my uh, mouse here. So, I'll have to remember that for later. Hoi! Another painting. Hoi! But using our actual skills, this this gust thing and our little fireballs seem really, really good here. So we did get hurt there, unfortunately. Um, a lot. My god, a lot. Wow. Let's just fire them into the corner. I really like that um, fire one as well. Whoa. Brrr. Ooh, that's really cool. Uh, it's like a shotgun blast. I like that. Oh my god, when we get up close to enemies like that, it really pummels them. Wow, he really pummeled me though, he hit me for 30. Already taking a lot of damage on this first floor, it isn't exactly great for us. Ooh, I do not like this room. So, let's try and stay out of the way of all of this, Riff Raff. I wonder if they can get hit by it. Ow, ow. <laughs> oh my god, immediately just destroyed. Okay, difficult room is difficult. Oh, I keep missing. No. Okay, this might be this might be a failure of a run already. I'm doing really badly. As you can maybe already tell, I'm not stun locking enemies quite as much as I should be here. And I've already taken a significant amount of damage. It really doesn't help that I'm not finding. Oh my god. Really, it doesn't help that I'm not finding um, many enemies that are easy. I'm finding all the harder ones. <laughs> and I'm not finding any of the shops either. Like. How have we not found a single shop yet? What's going on? Okay, the Broly Ball got me. Boom. Gotcha, boy. Right, where's just like a single shop? Come on now. Nope, we found the boss first. Are you kidding me? Went every which wrong way we could have gone. There, of course, it's, it's right here. Um, health drops more frequently sounds very useful. Um, we've got... Uh, increase resistance to fire-based attacks. Regen health every time you pick up a chaos gem and increase armor based on the amount of cha uh, chaos gems held. Um, slowly, sl slightly lowers the knockback of all arcana. 
Um, let's go with the the raspberry cookie box. That seems like a very good one to have. Oh. Oh. I, I tend to overuse the dash in this game. That seems to be one of my main problems. There you go. Pushing him away. Seems to be the easiest way to deal with these guys. Yep, just push them off the edge. <laughs> nice and easy. Right, keep going. Found ourselves a care shop. Um, revived the low HP when defeated, but consumed half of current HP when picking up this relic. Relic, this relic's destroyed on use. Deal double damage, but receive double damage. Increase armor, but star price increase. Let's try the double trouble. I mean, I'm of course really close to dying already, which isn't great. But you've got to try things. You've got to try things. Um, whereabouts are we going now? I think we've got to go down this way, don't we? Yeah, we've got some enemies over here. Oh, hello. I thought they were statues. But they are not statues. So, as long as we don't get hit too much, this could be a very, very powerful little build we got going here. But that is provided we don't get hit too much, which I just got hit a lot. I just got hit for 50. Wow. Okay, this, this might have been a bad idea. This might have been a real bad idea. Oh my god, look at this damage. It's insane. I love it, but I am going to die. Oh my god, we can kill things with like just our spells and nothing else. Right, let's just take a look at our map, see where we need to go here. Um, we've got to go up this way, and we've also got to go up that way as well. We've got quite far to go, actually. Quick. So, jump of this. Do not fall. Falling would be just horrible. Just horrible. Thank god then the icicles aren't shooting anymore. Because that would definitely get me hurt. Okay, so we've got our kind of shop. Not exactly, not exactly like we can use any of these. Blast enemies away with the plume of flames. Can be charged for a boosted effect. Let's try that out, shall we? And... Ooh, that's cool. Boom. I like that. Right. Okay, so... For this boss, I'm, I'm pretty much just going to um, stay as far away as possible. Apart from when we've got our opportunities to attack. Otherwise, get the hell away is going to be my main course of action. Oh, damn it. I'm at 6 HP. <laughs> 6 HP in a dream. Oh, my God. And we got the pinwheel. I think that's increased air damage, which is actually really nice because we are using air damage base attacks. And there you go. That's the first lot done with um, a rather, rather rocky start, so to say. I swear, wait a minute. Everyone always asks me as soon as I start recording. It's crazy. Um, God damn. There you go. <laughs> like, I swear, my, my Discord, I'm like, nope, no one's, no one's messaged me. And then as soon as I start recording, it's like, hey, hey, let's... Oh, do not get hit by that big boy. Do not get hit by that big boy. That would be just the worst. Just the worst. And there you go, extra HP. Thank God we got that cookie box. And we definitely want to buy a healing potion. Uh, what else have we got here? Um, basically, I kind of have an extra combo. Summons a shield that reflects one projectile. Shield breaks after reflect and respawns on a timer. That could be quite useful. Taking damage increases your max HP, but only to a certain limit. That could also be useful. Depends on if it, if it increases your maximum HP based on the amount of damage you take, though. Okay, definitely a good idea to get those out of the way. Good job we're doing a lot more damage to all these ice-based enemies as well, which is definitely helping out. Oh my god, oh my god. I tried to charge up my bloody thing and it messed up so bad. Do not bother charging it up. That is a dangerous game. I just lost so much HP for basically no reason. That was a bad, bad decision on my behalf. Whoa there, boy. Oh my god, I'm so dead. Yep. <laughs> Ooh, baby. That was that was an obvious death coming there, wasn't it? <laughs> Let's change around our arcana a little bit. I want to go with um, maybe a, an earth-based one or something like that. We've got 38 here, so we can maybe try and roll for something a little better here. Let's try and roll for another dash. We don't have any other dashes. We'll try and re-roll for a, a, a decent one here. We did a little bit of this in the last run. Um... Nah. It's hard to know what's a dash and what's not, but we'll, we'll we'll find out. We'll find out. None of them look like dashes. God damn it, game. Give me a dash. Come on. Just do it for me. Um, 
Rupture the air, Thor Apple Tunnel Vine, so I can see your damage energies in a line. Oh my god, it's not selling me any dashes. What's this one called, actually? It does actually say dash in the name, so maybe maybe all the other ones do as well. A burr? Um, toxic bowlers. Hell, bowlers made of toxic vines to entangle enemies. That sounds really cool. We should also really be checking our relics as well in case we get some really cool ones there. What the hell is this? Um, engulf and fissure. Strike the ground, creating a burst fissure that ensnares nearby enemies. That sounds really cool. Um, increase critical hit chance. Let's go with increased critical hit chance. Go with this as well. And let's try and get one more. One more new Arcana. I still find it really weird how easily you can just re-roll them here. And um, we've got like an Earth Grasp as well here. Let's get that too. Um, right, so let's change over these a little bit. So I'm going to go with the Fists. For my basic. I want to try those out. For my Dash, unfortunately, that is all I have. We got ourselves this Engulfing Fissure. And the Earth Grasp. Uh, let's go with the Earth Grasp for this one. And then for our last signature, let's go with... We don't have anything Earth-based yet. So let's go with the Dragon Circuit and try that out. And then for this, we'll go with the Increased Crit Chance. Because that sounds like it would be very, very useful. There you go. Increased Crit Chance sounds really good. And let's keep going, shall we? Okay, we did actually... I think we used the Lightning Circuit before. Unfortunately, we're starting off on the Lightning-based attack. Although, I think... Do ground attacks do more against lightning? That makes sense, doesn't it? I think. So, we can do that to grab... Oh, my God. Already 100 health gone. More than 100 health gone. Okay, so these fists are rather slow and difficult to use. But combined with the grasp, are pretty good. We definitely don't want to be using them against big enemies, though. That's apparent. Okay. Let it fire. Oh, they, they are very slow. We definitely need some attack speed up if that's something we can get in this game. Because that's going to be real annoying otherwise. So, unfortunately, I'm going to have to use that there. Okay, we. I see how that works now. I've just realized how, um, how the hand grasp thing works. They've got to be in a radius near us and then the hand grasps them. And that's when we can start doing a lot of damage. Okay, that seems a bit more... Sensical now. I was using that kind of in the wrong way before. I think we always want to initi initiate with an either. Um, here we can get scales. Allows you to lower active cooldowns and steal speed from enemies by blasting them with air. Mm, not too interested in any of those, to be honest. So we'll in initiate with this. And then we'll right click here. We got one of them, fortunately not both. But we can keep him locked away for now. And there you go, we got some healing as well. Very nice. So, get ready to queue up. This is our boss. We don't want to do anything with this guy yet. Q is the way to go to start combat. And then we get in there. Right click to hold them still. Just got to make sure we get all of them held still. It's kind of a pain if we if we miss that and end up having one behind us. Because we end up too focused on one enemy. Alright. I'm going to move around a little bit until this is ready. Excuse me? It didn't hit either of them because they're inv invisible. Oh my god, I didn't realize that, that that would be like that. Oh, they both gave me healing though. That's very nice of them. What? No! What? We're getting a lot of healing right now and I'm very happy about it. I don't know why, because we don't have the cookies anymore, but I'm very happy about it. I managed to keep my health kind of topped up without really even trying, which is beautiful. Um, so we've still got one more way to go over here. Probably Chaos Chop. I really like that that destroys projectiles so easily. I I'm not a big fan of these fists, to be honest. They're very, very slow. Okay, so let's let's focus on this guy here. Oh, the crit chance as well is beautiful. And here we go. Increase resistance to air base attacks. Allows you to destroy enemy projectiles with melee. Uh, increase resistance to fire. Some of the sprite that allows, uh, that slows enemies. Okay. Um, or we can fully refill our HP. I'm just going to refill my HP. I'm, I'm not actually that invested in anything on this floor. And wait, there's still one place we haven't been to. Where? Down here, maybe? Let's go to... Yeah, I think it's down there. Go to blue and then go down. I didn't even realize. I'm so sorry. Yeah, it's down this way. What? 
Oh, hello. Um, what do you do? Give me one of your arcana to shuffle, and I'll let you choose to keep one from my hand. Yeah, I'm game. I'm down. Oh, you took my grasp. At least it'll give us an enhanced one back. I'm happy with that. Um, we can go with... Um, let's try out, let's try out this one, Vacuum Seekers. Uh, that, an upgraded version, is, uh, now this one's Vortex on impact that slows enemies and deals additional damage. That sounds really good. I'm happy with that. So, I, I would like to keep the grasp, but honestly, re-rolling right now is what we're about, so. Oh, I like that. I like that a lot. Oh my god, I like that. I mean, this this boss is, is is rather annoying, right? Oh my god, the damage on that was insane. Wow, I liked that a lot. That damage was really, really good. And we get ourselves the timer, which I always forget what that does. Um... When taking damage at low health, briefly removes cooldowns and all I can. That's useful later on, but for right now, it doesn't really do anything for us. So, I'm so happy to have it. This run is definitely going better than the last one. I think the curse thing we took last time was a little bit of a risk, but I'm really liking these vacuum seekers. They're very cool. So, it seems like we open with Q. And then we try the vacuum seekers. Oh, I was hoping that maybe it would just kill them. Good, good. Oh, he's not dead. What the hell? Die, heathen. I must have missed a lot of shots on him during that combat there. At least this stun locks really easily. That's very nice. Keeps us safe, although it does lock us into an animation, which is a bit long. I love that. That is so, so good. The ultimate on that is, is brilliant. It's so sexy. It's so many places. Hey, hello. What you got for us? Uh, Gain seems to charge every time you pick up a Chaos Gem. Uh, it's not great. Summon a sprite that poisons enemies. Um, only one sprite can be held at a time. Mm. Asmore used to all multi-use arcana. What's a multi-use arcana? Oh, oh. Like a Q. That seems great. Um, increase overall signature charge gain from attacking enemies. Let's go with that. That means we get three charges on this bad boy. I think. One. That sounds really good. Because when we can open combat with three of these. Which sounds really, really awesome. Yeah, we get three of those. That's great. I mean, on its own, it's almost kill. Yeah, on its own, it's almost killing enemies. Which is great. That is a very big increase to our damage there. And we could hopefully try and build to that as well. Um, two of those... You're made of air! How do you fall off something? You're made of air! Come on now. <laughs> You're literally made of the thing you fell into. What's wrong with you? That was bizarre. I'm confused by that. Fit. Always push things into gaps. Makes life easier. Unfortunately, you cannot push them onto the spikes. Oh, yes. You were getting wrecked. This is great. Oh, no. <laughs> we're stunlocking enemies so much. It's brilliant. I'm loving it. Give me some curses to go on. I love the care shops in this game. They're so good. <laughs> this is beautiful. This is just such a wombo combo. Where the hell do we need to go now? This way? I think so. Oh, God. Ow! I got hurt so much there. Just kill this guy. Ignore the little thing that's trying to shoot, shoot me. There you go. Oh. We need a bit of healing here, but I'm in love with this. There's our boss. We need to go up and around this way. We've got all three of these ready again. 
Calm down hitting me. Look at that, it just broke them all. There you go. Oh, we got our signature ready. Let's try and use it. Wherever we can use it. No. Wait, do we not have a red area? Where's the red one? We got we're missing two. How did we go so wrong? Um uh, map? Oh, we missed that entire bottom section. Whoopsie. I'm very bad at mapping this area. Very bad at mapping it. <laughs> Super easy to miss things, at least for me. Oh, just get him locked in. And there you go. Locked in and done. And what are you? I'm studying the effects of long-term arcana use. Would you like to donate an arcana to research? I'm guessing that we can donate an arcana for healing. I am sorry, but I would not like to do that. You seem like a swell lassie, but no thank you. If we can upgrade our dash, um, that would be... Create a shockwave that uh, buffets your foes in your path. We can try and get an extra into a calming state where every last hit of your basic arcana loads all cooldowns. Um, yeah, let's, let's try that. Let's try that out. Because our last hit is always our second hit, isn't it? So, that seems like it would work pretty well. So, let's go here. No, I don't want to use you. Shut up. I want to go through here. So, we do that. We go E, E, E. Oh, that's not E. Um, okay, this is a annoying boss, if I remember correctly. Don't let him hit you. Okay, so, now let's... Oh my god, he just keeps spawning stuff. Okay, that's that's pretty good. That works. That works. Oh my god, stop spawning things. Okay, no, let's just finish him now. There you go. <laughs> okay, that was that was annoying, but we got through it. And we got some healing, and we also got some gloves. Oh no, that's a parachute. Uh, increase resistance to air base attacks, 25%. That's not bad. Um, not every, every enemy is going to do air base attacks, but when it does, that's going to be nice. Hopefully we have air on the next floor. Oh no, that was air, wasn't it? Oh, that was lightning. We don't even have air in our list. God damn it. Boom. Yo. I remember beating these before. I, I think I can do it again. Let's do it. So let's let them do their attacks. One, two, three. Oh my god. So that's two. And then this will be three. Got him. Wow, this attack's really cool, but I can never dodge it. <laughs> and the last one. Get him. Oh my god, what the hell? It looks so cool. I dodged it, yay. Oh, oh, oh. Now this one I cannot dodge. Stand very still. I can't get my signature going. Oh my god, I've not seen this one before. That one was new. What's the last one? It's this one again. Just run, just run. We can get him, we can get him. Yes! We got him. That extra crit chance is really helping us out a lot. I'm liking this a lot. Nice, and of course we get the signature right at the end, and then we have, you can, wait, what? What? Um, unleash a pair of crisscross fire beams that damage and burn enemies, increase damage and range. Oh my god, that's amazing. <laughs> that's so cool. I want that in my belly all the time. That's awesome. So... Oh my god, so that's that's an initiator then. So we always want to have E ready and going. That that little ball of, of weirdness that's there. Ah, boss is here already. Okay, hello. You were a bit early. What? It missed? Are you kidding me? Oh my god. Boom! Oh, I love that so much. 
Gimme. Yes, I need more HP. I'm running low. I've taken some bad hits. Some bad juju. I love that so much. There we go. And you can go down too. <laughs> that fire beam thing's so cool. Right, let's get ready. Look at that. Get all the things going. Oh my god. It's the fact that this slows them as well is so nice. Oh my god. I didn't I did not come into this prepared. I did not come into this prepared. Just shoot us all of them. <laughs> Kill them all. Yes, that works. Right. Take me to your shop. Ah! Right. That'll do for that. Got you. And we got some Arcana for that as well. We got that as our uh, as our backup. Hmm. Okay. I don't think I'll use that for now, but it's nice to know it's there. Oh, we could do reduce cooldowns by half but receive double damage. Um, use gold to increase spell damage. Having insufficient gold causes your spells to do less damage. Ooh, that sounds a bit risky. Um, expand all your gold at the start of each floor and heal for a fraction of the expanded amount. They all sound a bit risky. They all sound a bit too risky for my liking. Um, increase all damage for every enemy defeated, but lose effectiveness when taking damage. Um, taking damage increases your max HP. All gold costs are discounted. All gold costs are discounted. So we'll definitely take that um, for now. And then we'll come back and have a little look what else we want later on, I think. We shall see. We shall see. But yeah, the run's starting to get a little bit complicated now. We've got so many working parts that it's difficult to keep it all together, if you know what I mean. Um, it's kind of hard to, to know when we're doing what. And when we're meant to be doing what, at least. Oh, my God. I really love that. Oh my god, we can just keep hitting him. We can just keep hitting him. The bosses are going down so fast. And we got ourselves a cursed one from the boss? I don't even know what that was. I really hope it was something good. Oh my god. Uh, immediately pressing forward into an attack will guard the attack and stun the enemies nearby. You recover slower from attacks. Oh my god. So. Pressing forward into attack will guard the attack. I don't know what that means, but we'll we'll see. We have it now, and it's cursed, so we can't get rid of it. So we'll see how that goes. That could be really bad. Does mean that if we find the other gauntlet, though, we've got a good little thing going on there. We can get like this synergy thing. Oh my! Well, that was a great start. So far, so good, right? So far, so good. We're just taking like all the damage in the world. My God, that was not a good opening to a room. Oh, uh, hello. I don't even really know what happened there. Good, good, good. You're dead. I'm not killing anything. What's going on? It's because I'm not using my Q enough. Oh, I'm sorry, dude. That was a bit overkill. Didn't mean to wreck you like that. Didn't mean to wreck you like that. But what's done is done. Okay, there you go. I got the guard thing, then. I don't know what the guard thing's doing for us. Does it mean we don't take any damage or something? I really don't know, but we want to use our signature as quick as possible here. But you two are dead. Apparently not. Almost, but not quite. Wow, this build has kind of fallen apart. I think I think it's got too many working parts now, and I'm getting confused and overusing some things, underusing others. And I'm, I'm getting wrecked. Like that. Oh, my God. Oh, unfortunately, we took another beating there. Another beating. Let's see what we can get. And we can maybe fit one more run in. A sledgehammer.
Yes. Yes, please, a sledgehammer. And we can get a shovel. Increase air damage. Oh, yes. Regen health every time. Okay, let's, let's, let's go with the hammer. Literally all we have so far is offensive. And let's go with a full-on, full-on dirt build. So we can go here. That can stay the same. That can stay the same. Earth hammer. Oh my god, that's amazing. <laughs> what does his signature do? I'm loving it. I'm loving it. I want an earth dash though. Give me earth dash. Full earth build. Come on. How rare can it be? Just a simple earth dash. Found a water dash. Yeah, fuck it. We'll take the water dash. That'll do us. Good, good. So now we can go zoom, zoom. And there's a little frozen avatar of us behind. Right, in we go. Lightning floor again to start out. We can do it though. We can do it. I'm liking that a lot. Okay, we got we got to get used to how to effectively use our um, our right click, our our grasp, because otherwise I'm going to keep using that wrong. There you go. That's that's better. Oh my god, that's so good. We did take a lot of damage there, but that's still amazing. Oh, I'm loving that combo. Even destroyed that chest for us at the end there. What we got here? What's 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 going on with you? Is there anything quite as splendid as management of power of gold? Let's make a deal. All of your gold for all of my chaos gems. I mean, I've got 73, so yeah, let's go for it. How many did I get there? Only 21. Ugh, that wasn't very worth it. That definitely wasn't very worth it, falling into that pit. That was lovely. Can you, can you not, sir? I'm loving this combo, by the way. It's a bit dangerous. I'm having to get quite close to enemies for it to work. And I kind of need my cooldowns before I do it, but it's fun. I'm enjoying it. Okay, it doesn't seem to work on big guys, which is definitely a flaw. Oh, no, it does work on big guys. I just missed somehow. I don't know how I missed, but apparently I did. Right, keep going this way, see what we can find. Hello? What the hell? I want this. I got an aura. Oh my god. It even leaves a we can even leave a freeze at the end there to finish him off. Get in the pit. Damn it. I was hoping to push that guy in the pit right at the end there. I love this hammer thing. This hammer's so good. <laughs> what do we even get at the end of that there? Someone's a sprite that slows enemies. Okay, cool. Oh my god. What's with the insane amount of damage I'm taking? What the hell? I I don't like these lightning archers. They're too they're too strong. <laughs> They deal so much damage so fast, and I fall in pits, and I'm just terrible at this game. Oh, my God. I'm so bad. Right, let's keep going. There you go. And there's one left. We can we can deal with you. I like the way they've got this little enemies bar on the mini-map there. That's kind of cool. We are very melee-centric, so we can't really do anything to these guys for a sec. That was beautiful. Oh my god, they didn't even die. What? But it was beautiful. This just isn't... <laughs> this build is cool, but it's too melee-centric. I think it gets way too close to things before they die. Don't want anything from there. I do want something from the green shop, though, wherever that may be. Let's have a little look on the map sheet, shall we? It's up that way, so let's go red...
most likely here at least. Yeah, let's take that. Um, adds a chance to freeze foes. Oh, I can't quite afford that. That's a shame. I might be able to afford it after the boss though. Excuse me, sir. Oh. Get hit, boy. Oh my god, I got hit by him so bad, though. Got him. Right, let's go back to our shop here, because we've got enough gold now. Chance to free sounds really good. Permafrost cube. Right, keep on going. I'm surprised we made it through that, honestly. I was feeling at the start there that like that run was definitely going quite far south and, and kind of going quite badly wrong, but... <laughs> Anyways, anyways. Like, the, the hand just missed this guy then. Oh my god, I'm taking so much damage again. Uh, I thought that pot was a human. Turns out, no. It's a ceramic pot. Ah! Okay, so melee-centric builds, we need a little something-something to make these work, I think. I mean, that definitely is, like, the best way to go. That is so satisfying. And all those crits, look at that. Oh, <laughs> let's get somewhere with it while we've got signature. Let's do it. Kill this piñata. Oh, we got it. Nice. We got ourselves a thing. Nice. <laughs> Having that ready at the right time there was beautiful. We killed a piñata. And that was beautiful in itself. Good, good, good. And we found our boss. We still haven't found half of the enemies. Uh, let's go blue. Down. Boom, boom, boom. I love my hammer throw. It's so big and beefy. Oh my god, I could die here though. Oh my god, thanks for the healing. Thank the lord for that healing. The chance for freezing is like, pretty good actually. No. No! No! <laughs> Damn it. Another death. Either way, that's going to be a nice end off for Wizard of Legend. I hope you guys have been enjoying this series. I've been enjoying playing this game quite a lot, even though I'm atrociously bad at it. Either way, hope you guys have enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next one.